want to switch gears to talk about new developments in the Johnny Depp Amber Heard saga. Most recently, a juror came forward to do an exclusive interview with ABC News on their decision making process in the civil trial that spanned over seven weeks. While their identity was sealed, ABC correspondent Trevor Alt read aloud the juror's responses. So let's listen in as the juror described their reaction to both Johnny Depp and Amber Heard on the stand. The crying, the facial expressions that she had, the staring at the jury, all of us were very uncomfortable. She would answer one question and she would be crying, and two seconds later she would turn ice cold. Some of us use the expression crocodile tears. On Depp's side, a lot of the jury felt what he was saying at the end of the day was more believable. He just seemed a little more real in terms of how he was responding to questions. His emotional state was very stable throughout. So believe it or not, another day, more Johnny Depp, more Amber Heard news. Kurt, we know you have to sign off at the top of the hour, so we want to get your take on this juror's point of view. Are you surprised with this juror's take on both Johnny Depp and Amber Heard's time on the stand? No, not really. I think what that <laughs> juror said uh, was reflected in the verdict. Um, I think it's just confirmation of what we saw in the verdict. They just didn't believe Amber Heard, and it sounds like uh, Johnny Depp's testimony uh, was the believable part. They found he did some things wrong, maybe, but they liked him better. I mean, in the end, they liked him better and believed him uh, because she just was not credible. They didn't believe her tears. They didn't believe most of what she said. So what the juror said is super consistent with what we saw in that verdict. Janine, do you agree with that? No, I absolutely agree with that. Um, I think that she did have crocodile tears. I think that Amber Heard is not doing herself any favors with her behavior after this trial. So I, I, I think that she should be quiet. I think that we should move on and hopefully that will happen. Um, originally, I thought she was gonna try and kind of smooth some fences and maybe see if Depp, you know, because his attorneys had alluded that he may not seek to enforce the judgment, but you know, uh, she's just making it worse for herself. Should this juror, though, have waited to speak out considering Amber Heard's appeal process hasn't been completed yet, Janine? Not necessarily. I mean, th this is a juror from this particular trial, and this is what his um, observations were. And, you know, she's her attorney has insulted the jury, suggesting that they were on social media, which he says that they were not. And she has made some comments kind of, you know, dismissing them as, as you know, falling through the, the star quality of Depp. And so I think that, you know, the jurors kind of do want to speak out. So, you know, that's not what happened. What happened is we didn't believe you. Kurt, what do you think? No, I think that's right. I mean, you know, the jurors are probably happy to stay quiet, but then when their credibility or their, um, you know, gets called into question, somebody stood up for them and said, that's not what we do. That's not what we saw. We didn't care who they were. This is what we thought, and this is who we believed. Uh, the fact that the juror came out now to speak, got no responsibility to either the clients or either of the parties in the case right now. So if he wanted to, he wanted to, and, and there's nothing wrong with that. Well, we all thought that, you know, they would both move on and their lives would live happily ever after, but that is not the case in Hollywood, <laughs> nor for Johnny Depp or for Amber Heard. What is next for them both, Janine? Well, again, I still think that there could be a situation because Depp wasn't about the money. He was about clearing his name. So they could kind of, uh, you know, get her to drop the appeal in order of, uh, in, in exchange, he may not enforce the judgment. And I think that that would be best for everybody. This uh, trial was an absolute circus. I know we all kind of liked watching it, but, you know, at the end of the day, there were some really serious allegations, and I don't really think that we need another circus trial. Kurt, we have about 30 seconds. What do you think is next I for could both? not agree more. I could not agree more. They should go away. Amber Heard <laughs> should go away. I mean, Johnny Depp can make more movies, whatever he wants to do, but this case should go away, and they should move on and try to get on with their lives, because Amber Heard and even Johnny Depp's life is going to be different moving forward. Well, Amber Heard continues to talk, and I don't know if this is a good publicity <laughs> stunt for her at all or for her movie career. All right.